gives me a perspective around uh, what I do for a living, an appreciation for being on this stage. Uh, it motivates me to keep working hard so that I can be back here every year. And uh, I just enjoy the, the, the honor and opportunity to, to lace up my shoes with 23 of the best players in the, in the NBA uh, in a showcase for the fans. So pretty special opportunity. I think it was surreal the first time I got to be an All-Star, uh, 2014 in, uh, in New Orleans. And I don't think that feeling has changed much since, since then, you know, these last five years. So definitely appreciate it. Curry is more about the fun and relaxing or this time because of the new format, uh, like being LeBron against the second Curry is going to be more about the competition? It's both. I mean, we, like I said, we, this is a, it's the all-star break, if you will. So we want to try to, you know, refresh our minds and bodies. It's been a long season so far. We got, you know, the most important time coming up, but obviously uh, with the new format, I think it just kind of adds a little different vibe around the all-star game. And, should be a little bit more competitive, a little bit more uh, intense on the court tomorrow. And there's a lot at stake from you know, uh, a, a pride standpoint, if you will. It's not just yeah. the Western Conference versus Eastern Conference anymore. It's Team Steph versus Team LeBron, so uh, I obviously want to win. Steph, you ever watch Lionel Messi play in Barcelona? Oh, uh, yeah. Um, who doesn't watch him? Is okay, that a question? So you got a jersey you want. Do you kind of feel or see yourself as somewhat comparable, not being the strongest athlete on the court, but with a really great, huge amount of ability that defies in some way the prototypical player of their sport? Yeah, just the, I think it's a creative genius to what he does uh, and a flair, but also there's a, there's a fundamental aspect to the flair, if, if you will. Um, the work that he puts in, I'm assuming, based on his, you know, the talent that he has, and combining that with the talent that he has, and, and how that kind of shows when he's out there on the pitch, right? So, uh, I think there's a lot of comparison really around the creativity and, and the, uh, the innovation that we bring to our respective sports, and trying to, uh, you know, I guess impact. I would say influence the next generation to try to you know push themselves as well. Do we as Argentina are top candidates for the World Cup? You think? Oh, I don't know much about that. So uh, <laughs> good luck to you, I guess. Yeah. <laughs>